Hey guys, it's just been announced that Allen Iverson and Shark will be running um, Reeboks. Now you know Allen was one of the, um, one of most faces, most memorable faces of the shoe brand, and of course Shark was I think it was even before him had one of the best, uh, one, one of the first um, shoe a basketball shoe brand. And um, eventually they sold that and went to do like shag, shag, whatever they call it, eh, 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 with Walmart and this and that. There. But now both Shag kind of like Shag and his um, venture company that he part owner of bought Reeboks when they were going to a financial um, trouble. And Allen C got like a, a twenty million dollar um, reserve money that after he retired, I think when he reached a certain age, they would give it that to him. Um, and they're still like uh, reselling uh, his shoes. Like his shoes is one of the shoes that they be reselling. It turned to a classic, right? People are still try to buy it now. As we know, the whole classic thing going on with with, with, with street shoes, with street shoes, shoe wear and stuff like that. Um, now they try to bring them each other back. So in a new deal, it look like um, uh, um, Shaq gonna be the president and Island Harris are going to be the vice president. And I think like it's a way to like culturize the the brand. Now the brand is also kind of like a little bit wishy washy because they are selling product in Walmart, which is downgrade the value of the brand because you know Walmart is supposed to be low, low value, right? If maybe if it was like Target, we can understand because normally brand will have a create a lower tier for a brand, but you know what I mean. At the end of the day, Walmart is a selling platform, just like Macy's and whatever, right? But, you know what I mean? It, it, I don't know if they're making the quality different or whatever. Um, and they still sell the shoes in uh, any shoe store, like Finish Line, later and third. But, it's like, uh, do I want to buy a Reeboks or do you want to buy a Nike or uh, Adidas or, you know what I mean, or, or, or stuff like that. But we'll see what happened. I don't know. Now you know Shaq and Island Iverson are running their shoes. Do you think it's gonna be more culture? Do you wanna gonna buy it? Do you think they're gonna work with people who understand black culture and then try to create something people are gonna buy now? Because the the the, the company is similar to be focused more in, in basketball. Basketball is not only thing, man. Like I like wearing basketball shoes, but the more popular shoes are like running shoes and like they are low 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 um low 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 cut shoes where you can dress up with suits you can dress up with dress pants those are very nice to wear and like even running shoes they are they are classic style with number you know what i mean so, so i think that they are not only focus on basketball but they diversify their like running golf you know all things like that we're branding it and focus and try to get more people to like like them and stuff like that but Never mind, I thought I might report that to you guys. Let me know what you think about that. If you're first like to my channel, thank you so much for watching. Why are you there? Go like video, share video, hit the notification bell, and I'll see you in the next one, guys. Deuces.